Okay, hey guys, welcome back. Um, this sounds absolutely retarded, but most girls can't cook, but they can cook better than most guys. But um, this is the stupidest thing I've ever heard. It's not stupid, single moms. It's got like some chemical dust you put in the pasta. Most kids are so spoiled they live on macaroni and cheese and Twinkies and anything wrapped in paper. So there's a lot of bad parents out there. I'm making a, a real macaroni and cheese. Like if, if I was in business, these guys would be out of business. So let me show you how I do it real quick. If the camera could come over. I try to explain how to start off with a, with a roux with butter. And basically a roux is you take butter and flour, all purpose flour, and you cut, you start combining it. If you want to yield a large amount, don't let your um, roux brown. If you want a lot of flavor, you let the roux brown like it is now. So the roux got there, and I don't have editing equipment to to do this. But basically, we're going to make a cream sauce here, and then we're going to put the cheese into the cream, couple eggs, whatever. And we're going to make the most kick-ass um, macaroni and cheese. So anyway, our roux is brown. It's ready to um, get some cream. And we also have some low-fat milk. And this is going to... And oh, also, I also threw like four um, cloves of garlic in this one. So we're going to start off like this. I'm not going to make another one, but another cooking video on mac and cheese because... Girls, if you're stupid enough to date a guy that can only make macaroni and cheese and not the real macaroni and cheese, dump them, and you dump them fast. So, um, let me get this going. The roux's going. It's going to be lumpy. Camera person, come up. The roux's lumpy. It's flour with the butter, with the garlic. We'll let it reduce. So, just in a nutshell, to keep this video short, once I get this flour dissolved into here, I'm going to integrate the cheese in here until it's a cheesy, cheesy mixture. And then I'm going to let it cool down a little bit and I'll crack one or two eggs in it while the mixture is cold. After that, I will stir it up. I will pour it over the um, macaroni and I will bake it at 350 for 25 to 30 minutes and it's really yummy. So. Anyway, um, I promise to make funnier cooking videos in the future, but this is all I had out of This is all I had today to give back to my fans from here in Las Vegas. Also, Carl Bear, the Cajun cook from Louisiana, a great um, sauce chef, my dad, Glenn Mungin. There's a lot of daddies out there that can cook, so God bless you. So, over and out from Vegas.